You would do the same thing for postpartum. The only difference is for postpartum, you would start at the hips. Are you, are you see stress, it going that's up? That's what shed, um, spreads during pregnancy. Okay. Why you see it lifting up on it, going up under? Yeah. 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 And you want to make sure that the back is supported too because that's where all her tension is going to be at during this process. She may not say yeah, it hurts, but it hurts. How much back is Is that, I think that was one of the suggestions for iron too, because mm -hmm. your saturation needs to be a little higher. Okay, so not too much vitamin C, C though, because vitamin C yeah, can cut iron. No, but it helps the iron. But you need to mm -hmm. do your fluids, you okay, know, with it, the water. I think it's all. There's something. Something I was reading said drink orange juice with your meals. I think it was what I sent you. Mm -hmm. Did I send you one for um, iron deficiency? A resource sheet? Oh, no, not for iron deficiency. Okay, I'll send that to you. But I don't know if that's where I was reading that. Because I have that on there too. Orange okay. juice does help. You just don't want to consume too much vitamin C. I don't like orange juice, so. It's going to be a lot of things you don't like mm -hmm. that you're going to have to get used to being a mama. Mm -hmm. So get used to it now. This is, this what is the power. What about oranges? Like, that's vitamin C. Can I just eat straight oranges? I'll do little cuties. I like those. Are those real oranges? Yeah, it's, it's, it's interesting. interesting to see. <laughs> they buy me a seafood. You can drink lemon with your tea. Uh, okay. Make fresh lemonade. I usually drink lemon with water. You could do that too. That's citrus. Yeah. <clears throat> Kiwis. Mm -hmm. Grapefruit. Um, what else? You do? So when you wrap, you just want to make sure you're wrapping the whole stomach. Now, this is a little itchy. That's itching. You, like you were already itching before. Yeah. So if you do this, do it over top of clothes. Okay. Okay. And if you're sensitive because of the pregnancy, and that's why you're itchy, so. then you probably want to do both wraps over the clothes. Okay. And what are you washing your clothes with? Um, what's in there now, babe? Orange hammer? I think it's on the Um, Even when I'm naked, it's just, <coughs> it's your, it's your hormone changes. Yeah. It's a lot of weird things happen to our bodies. Mm -hmm. Not just as women, but during pregnancy the most. Mm -hmm. And then it happens again during menopause. So this is all the prep work. You said you wanted to be prepared. Mm -hmm. This is being prepared because there's no preparing for motherhood. This is the prepare right here, being pregnant. This is where it starts. How do you feel? Other than itchy. It feels okay. It, this one's a little tighter. 